Hey guys, what's going on? This is Dale Radisson giving you an update on the squash plants. I'm really happy to see that uh, they are taking off. Uh, these are self-growing planters. They grow your food for you. They require no human intervention. And that's what we're doing. I want to show you, look at my squash. Look at that. She is doing so good. And look at her sister over there is doing so good also. Forgive me, we had a huge rain yesterday. And we are so happy with what I went and tried to fertilize the squash myself, um, excuse me, pollinate the squash myself, because we didn't have a lot of squash bees. Some I was successful with, some I weren't successful with. That's one I was not successful with. If you don't have a pollination process, where we would take the, the male, fly, the male uh, pollinators right here that I'm pulling off, and now we're going to attach it to the female pollinators. I see a squash over there that I wanted to show you guys, so you can take a look at it. Here's one plant that's just opened up, and it's just opened up today. You can only catch them like one day. And so you see, can you see that plant right there? And so what I need to do is take the male, attach it to the female, rub it in there as much as possible, have it closed. Oh, look at all those pollinators. Oh my gosh. See them all on my hand, fingers? Yeah. Oh my gosh. And so I will pollinate the squash. So as you can see, we might, out of this one planter, be able to do, I don't know, maybe about, oh my gosh, I'm hoping maybe about five, uh, six squash out of this one planter, just by itself. Daryl Addison, torpedopod.com, and there's more to come. Daryl Addison at torpedopod.com.